welcome back to SourceFed. I'm Lee Newton. I am Elliot Morgan. In order to literally watch the spread of cancer, researchers have surgically implanted small glass windows into the bellies of living mice. <laughs> windows? Well, what's next? Doors? You can just, just open it up and move crap around? <laughs> Wait, I'm sorry, windows? I was yeah. too busy trying to layer with sarcasm that I completely missed the... Windows? Yeah. Yeah, buddy. Yeah. Wouldn't kill you to listen every now and then, okay? Oh, oh, oh really? Oh, really? Wouldn't kill me to listen? What's well, listening, Lee? All right? I'm, I'm sorry. It's, it's hard to veer from... Yeah. Continue Windows Red. Well, the insights that the windows allow could actually help battle cancer. Over the last decade, researchers have developed these tiny glass windows that could allow implants on the skin and mammary glands of living mice. And the window implants make it so that the scientists can use microscopes to watch how breast cancer and tumors develop under the skin in real time. That is insanely awesome. I want a window. Okay, I would eat a, a Subway sandwich and then watch it go up in my tummy. <laughs> It's not even how the tummy works. Nobody knows how the tummy works. But until now, scientists have lacked the windows that could help them see liver, spleen, lungs, bone marrow, and lymph nodes. You know all the different organs that lend themselves to metastasis. Most cancer deaths are actually caused by metastasis, and most of that process is unknown. But now with those windows, scientists say they can get a direct view. <laughs> And little windows, which kind of look like portholes into mice, don't actually impair the mice's movements and don't cause inflammation or infection, which was a major worry. Lee, uh, do you think they'll ever come to a point where I can get a porthole? Hey, I, I don't, I don't know, I buddy. certainly hope they do, because aside from my tummy, I also want to be able to see my heart and watch it grow three times its normal size during Christmas season. Because I hate Christmas. You're an idiot. And with the real-time visualization of tumor growth, it shows that tumor cells are much more dynamic than we anticipated based on the snapshot images we were taking prior. And why is this important? Because we're trying to find certain drugs that suppress cancer and fight it. And of course, further research is always needed. But for me, I say these kinds of experiments are always fascinating and crazy important to medical research, especially when it comes to something as mysterious as cancer, a disease that lives in the land of the unknown and kills millions a year. And no, I don't really want a tummy window, okay? Okay. That's crazy. A brain window, however, okay. would be awesome. Okay. All right. All right. So guys, if you could have a window, where would it be? Let us know in the comment section down below. And while you're down there, like, subscribe, click this annotation for our five daily stories. Go to sourcefed.com for word type news. Also, go to Four Human Peoples. Stock up on all of your SourceFed gear so you can decorate every inch of your living space with it. I'm Elliot Morgan. I'm Lee Newton. We'll see you tomorrow with comment commentary. Ooh, I put it right here, too. And, and then that's where all of the it's love so and right joy there. and delight would go Come right out here. Come out the booty. Come out the booty. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.